Hi everybody, my name is Christopher Soto. Welcome back. Uh, today we're going to be teaching you all how to tie a tie. Um, everybody should learn how to tie a tie. It's pretty important. Um, eight reasons I learned why to tie a tie is because uh, I've done security for about like two years now. And, uh, our uniform is full suit attire. Uh, it's uh, black slacks, it's uh, slack pants, uh, black dress shoes, suit, white collar shirts. Uh, normally it's a choice of, uh, this is a the tie they provide is my uniform tie. Uh, you could also do uh, black ties um, if you want to switch it up. Uh, so today I'm going to teach you all how to tie a tie. It's pretty important too. Um, whenever you, you never know when you're going to be needing it. Uh, anybody could wear a tie. You could dress professionally, fancy, and occasional. So today, uh, to the tie, there's two ends to it. There's the presentation side. And then there's the skinnier side. So today we're going to be popping your collars, making sure you have your buttons on, uh, flush them, press down. Um, it just makes tying your tie easier. So when we're tying our tie, when you buy them, it normally comes with these two uh, grooves in them that come into every tie normally. Uh, it's just kind of to help you measure out uh, the length of the tie. Uh, they, they do that when they make them. So for this one, we're going to use as representation our thumbs where the hinges are. Once again, making sure our collar is nice and clean. Just makes everything easier. And we're going to make sure. Remember, you can always adjust as needed. So we're doing this for this uh, specific knot. We're doing the full Windsor knot. It's going to be the left hand is going to be on your shorter, skinnier side. Your right hand is going to be on your uh, uh, representation side, your presentation side. So when you're putting it around your collar, always remember it's left on your left hand for the skinnier side, and then your right one is the presentation side. So it's going to be open around for this one. Remember. So now it's left hand over your right hand for the skinnier one. Making sure everything is nice and detailed. You're going to put your left hand up and over. As, remember, as you're doing this, you want to always make sure that you're holding everything. Just so everything comes out nice and easier for you. And everything comes out just as the way you want it. And then you just want to drop the presentation side over everything as you did the up and over the bridge. And then as you're doing this, you're going to want to let it hang over the skinnier side and you should be pitching it as you're grabbing it. Once you're pitching this, you want to swing this presentation side up and over the skinnier side and you're going to almost as if you're making, call it like a little burrito or like grabbing a tortilla. Remember, you're pinching everything so you have your knot as you like it. And once again, once you're wrapping everything over, you're going to want to let this drop. So now you have presentation over the knot. And then once you're dropping this, you're going to grab your presentation side. And you're going to switch hands on the one you're pinching this with. And you're just going to want to... As you should notice, there's a little sleeve pocket right here. The reason that pocket is made is so when we push our tie through, you end up with a nice nice finish. So when you're adjusting this, you pinch the top and you pull down as you need to adjust your collar line. And that's how you adjust your collar right? And you always wanna, you always can pull and you can adjust your length as needed for your tie. And you can tuck away the excess tie into the provided pouch that they give you. And you can pull your collar back down. Remember, you can adjust. 
just as needed. And this is the full Windsor nut. It takes a bit of practice. I remember when I was learning at the time I tie, it wasn't easier for me at first, but it takes time. But at the end of the day, you know, you're learning it for a reason. And then, plus at the end, uh, I worked so many jobs and just doing it every day just kind of became a habit. And it just kind of becomes like a, like a practice that you just do. It's like brushing your teeth, you know? Pretty cool. And now you're ready for it. Thank you, everybody.